Hello and welcome. This is Shreya and you are watching Peace News International. Starting with the headlines. Nikki Jayanti Didi toured to Australia where she shared her insights on women leadership, inner resilience, meditation and more. International Day of Yoga celebrated by Brahma Kumaris in various countries. Renowned public figures and embassy staff members also attended the event. Brahma Kumaris Australia welcomed to wholeheartedly the additional chief of Brahma Kumaris PK Jayanti Didi. Didi travelled to Canberra, Melbourne, Sydney to attend various public programs and shared her insights on the significant subjects like women's leadership in troubled times in Canberra, meditation and peace buildings, learning and opportunities in Melbourne, and build inner resilience in Sydney. Yoga has already won the hearts of many far beyond India and has become their way of life. In view of this growing trend of yoga, International Day of Yoga was celebrated in Moscow as well, where Brahma Kumaris participated in many programs. One of them was a main Moscow event of the 9th International Day of Yoga in which PK Sudadidi participated and was inaugurated by the Ambassador of India to Russia, His Excellency Mr. Pavan Kapoor. P.K. Sudha Didi gave a lecture on meditation for purifying the mind. Many people were interested and wanted to learn more about Raj Yoga meditation. Naturally, they should start from very simple asanas, very simple exercises, so that the body develops that stretching ability. But when we talk of Raj Yoga, we do not need to practice any asanas in the practice of Raj Yoga. So here you practice, it is the yoga of the mind and the intellect. Another public event was organized by the Embassy of India in Moscow, where representatives of Brahma Kumaris B.K. Harish from Mount Abu, India, and Dr. Alexei shared special exercises for harmonious body and mind. Similarly, Brahma Kumaris were also invited by the Consulate General of India in St. Petersburg to the Yoga Festival organized at the Vrida Park, where they set up a stall named Space of Silence. BK members gave information about the basics of ancient Raj Yoga meditation and taught the method of meditation to the curious people who visited the store. Apart from this, a lecture was organized on the subject of Raj Yoga meditation at the Consulate General of India and was addressed by BK Santosh Didi, Director, St. Petersburg. One more celebration at Discovery City Park in Texas. Over 500 people participated along with the Consul General of India. On behalf of Brahma Kumaris, Brother Mark conducted the meditation session of International Day of Yoga Protocol and also explained the audience about Raj Yoga meditation. Similarly, another event conducted at Pearl Land Pavilion where the city mayor Cole attended the event and shared his view about physical and emotional health. Here, Brother Mark from Brahma Kumaris conducted meditation commentary through which everyone experienced deep silence. Sister Ricky, Brother Renner and Sister Steffi attended the UN International Yoga Day event at the United Nations in Vienna, which was hosted by the Austrian Indian Embassy Mr. Thie Muraz, the Protocol and External Relations Officer and Kavita Verma, the chairperson of this year's UN Bazaar, were present on this event. They also met several members of UN as well. Thanks for watching our broadcast today. We hope that you found our coverage informative and valuable. Join us again next time for more news and updates on events around the world. Until then, take care and goodbye.